Welcome to another Thank you, exciting five minute auto pairing. Let's try um, maybe a Scotch game, might be interesting, or a gambit, or a light gambit. I'll play a Scotch game. Let's see how this pans out. So, yeah. This is an equalizing. I think I've got to recognize this as an equalizing line for black, unfortunately. Let's put the knight on G3. There's knight H5 on the cards. Right, so he, um, he's uh, unpinning. Um, And the fort around there. Maybe knight h5. Or queen c2 and bishop f5. Can I do that just to try and get the uh, f5 square for a knight? Queen c2 and bishop f5. And also, if I'm just quicker to the e file here, I can just imagine queen c2 and just being quick on the e file. Although <laughs> it's not entirely uh, convincing. Like this is going to get any edge here, unfortunately. Maybe this is one of the reasons why the Scotch game isn't such a popular thing. I'm going to have to look this up. <laughs> Gasparov has used uh, the Scotch game with um, great success, but I think it was very theoretically prepared. Uh, Bishop b5. Um, Bishop f5. What do these actually do? If I want to weaken f5, I want to swap off this bishop, Check. I guess, with bishop f5. I'm not sure it's leading to anything. It's supported by both queen and knight, though. So um, so I can take with the queen without getting mated, uh, I hope. Um... Weakening f5, yes, it's not really original, but with h6, that is a kind of potential weak square. Ah, oh, okay. I'm tempted to land on g6. Tempting. Bishop takes h6, immediately threatened. Now he's got that b file. Is he going to actually use that b file? Well, bishop takes h6 here is, <laughs> is possible. That was a strange defensive move. Now there's queen takes f6, threatens. St very strange defensive move, king f8. Hmm, that was a panic. What was that? I wonder if his position was difficult there, and that's why. I do wonder actually. Queen e7, knight f5. Maybe that was the problem. I'm going to check that out pretty soon, I think. I think this is resignable now. Check. Oh, for him, he's losing a piece. Yeah, he's just resigned. Let's have a look at that position. This looks like a bog standard equalizer line for black. Yeah, it seems an idea. Knight f4, advantage to white. Hmm. C4. Thanks. Oh, all right. Knight f4. Has he done something bad here? Because I'm actually probably threatening. Let's see. Um, well, yes, he has. He's weak in d5. And knight f4 really just pounces on that and he can't even unpin. I think he has done something bad. Yeah? All right. Now, queen takes f4 is possible there. a3. Queen takes. Queen h5. Now if he moves here. Oh, okay. All right, knight f4 is good. Yeah. Better than knight. I even had it here. Oh, it's, it's an accurate play. 
so actually what I'm talking about black equalizing I think he's messed it up totally I think the bishop must be able to go back this is just looks wrong with the d5 pawn it actually looks really bad uh, if he plays bishop e6 here there's knight h5 there's, there's no unpinning resource okay I'll bear this in mind I might play the scotch game again I'll just bear this in mind this game because I, I very rarely play this scotch game check yeah I just thought that's dodgy to allow Queen g6 so immediately Bishop takes h6 is even possible here of course it is check check Crushing. check yeah now there's a defense here not Queenie so I think Knight f5 might have been what he was frightened of then if here Knight takes. check and yeah I think it's gone pear shaped here Rook takes e6 right and yeah <laughs> there's rookie seven on the cards Queen takes there and it's gone pear shaped doesn't it Bishop f4 I'm not sure what Bishop f4 does is that no good that's good as well but Bishop f4 apparently is really good oh to go here right yeah that, that oh that's that's the point of a6 uh, yeah it's, it's just dismantling black but even this line okay that's that's hopeless so you must play this there's no knight f5 there's still this now if he plays this there's still this it's still an issue isn't it so he might be busted after this I know in the Queen here he actually might be busted nearly uh, this this is the best check if this is the best she's lost the pawn but yeah this is much better than the game he's still alive it's only a small advantage now I think that's probably probably the B file B file pressure is compens is seen as compensation here yeah if you can clamp down and play um the clamping down and uh, actually that's equal isn't it or even better for black that potentially if he fragments two pawns so I think a3 is clamping down so yeah it's 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 not not entirely a great pawn if he played it correctly but it it turns out that the immediate bishop takes h6 yeah it was was very good so the immediate bishop takes h6 here is possible that in this position yeah yeah it's a disaster okay comments or questions on YouTube I might try this opening again thanks very much